Hi, I'm Raymond Webb. I'm a supervisor on the second floor at Shepherd's Heart Veterans Transitional Housing Program. Uh, we have um, 15 residents, um, 12 per diem veterans and three contract beds. Um, they can stay here anywhere from three months up to two years. Um, when they leave here, uh, normally they will have their own place, being able to sustain themselves, uh, meeting their individual goals. Um, some of my duties is uh, I am a counselor, um, sponsor, um, supervisor, gatekeeper. Um, I'm also a certified peer specialist. I'm on veterans court, um, jail diversion, um, uh, a wide spectrum of different things. Okay, back in um, 2000, I wound up coming into the VA healthcare system program. Uh, I myself was homeless. Uh, and that I ran into some problems with some drugs and alcohol and not being able to sustain myself and graduated that program. And that's where I met Past Reverend Mike, Pastor Mike. Um, and when I graduated there, uh, start working with Pastor Mike, uh, help driving the homeless um, from down Smithfield up to here and on Sundays. And he had a vision of opening up uh, transitional housing on the second floor for veterans. And I wound up doing that and he wanted me to be the supervisor and I became the supervisor. And by God's grace and mercy, I was able to be able to get a house, which I never thought that I would be able to do um, through Pastor Mike. Uh, we own our duplex. Uh, on the one side we stay and on the other side we rent to veterans um, and they can stay as long as they want and once they go we're going to just continue to help our veterans and they can just move move in it comes completely furnished uh, nice size yard and it's been a true blessing on a monthly basis uh, uh, I know anywhere up to 100 people a day, uh, and that on the Sundays they serve anywhere from 100 to 250 people. Um, they feed meals, um, the drop in center, which um, they can get prayer uh, resources to direct them to treatment centers, and um, there's outreach. Um, so it they're able to wash their clothes, take showers. There's a lot of resources here. Um, during the winter, they're the cold weather shelter for the women, um, one of two that's in the county. Uh, there's, uh, they have the free shuttle. Um, we serve a, a very vast amount of um, people throughout this area. Excellent. Uh, anywhere about 30%, 30 to 40% are veterans. Um, a lot of times the veterans will come here um, to build that trust, because uh, sometimes back um, in their early 90s and 80s, there was kind of a, not a mistrust in, of the VA healthcare system. And we're here and we help to bridge that. The VA healthcare system is wonderful now. Um, and a lot of times um, they'll come here and we're able to hook them, to connect them to different resources and they're able to get their, the services that they need. Uh, we have a, a wide range of services. Um, we have the, the free shuttle we have the drop-in where they can wash clothes, uh, take showers, they get a uh, meal in the mornings. Um, they also serve on Sundays where they're able to eat dinner. Um, it's a resource center. Uh, we have a lot of different resources. There's a lot of collaborations between different organizations and uh, we all seem to get along and communicate very well with each other. 
uh, it's one of uh, very few unique places that's in the city or even anywhere in the country, really. Um, if we were not here, uh, there would be a lot more people out on the streets. Um, the resources that we connect them up with um, seems to help in the, or sustain um, the crime rate would be higher, the jail rate would be higher. Um, they know that this here is a safe place. Okay. Through the VA, um, gifts in kind, uh, private donations, um, group organizations. Uh, we have different um, schools and colleges. Duquesne collaborates with us. Um, there's a lot of collaborations in that throughout the whole city. Uh, yes, the uh, telephone number is 412-281-1305, or they could go to the web, www.shephart.org and shephart.com. Uh, yes, um, winter gear, uh, some blankets, um, things of that nature, some shoes. Um, the cold weather is still lingering on, um, so we do have a need for things of that nature. Uh, yes, um, one of the very great things about Shepherd's Heart is that um, a lot of the graduates from here are on the staff mm -hmm. and that are here working, that they're employed through here. Um, a lot of the people that have graduated from here are also in the VA healthcare system and that um, a lot of them are continuing um, to be productive members in society and trying to teach others.